What is up, Backyard Bass and fans? All right, before we get into today's video, um, I want to send a very special thank you to Danny from 12 Again Sports. Uh, he's got a YouTube channel, which I will put that right here. And you guys can see that. Um, he did a giveaway here a couple weeks ago that I actually entered and I won. Um, just to show you one of the cool things I won, this is the hat that I got, which is pretty cool. Got my name embroidered in there, Backyard Bass, and that was pretty awesome. So I wanted to give him a big shout out, but he also threw me in just a little extra something for the giveaway, which what I thought was really awesome. So he's got this little, little box here for tackle. Um, and this actually comes in pretty handy because I've actually been talking about getting a little bitty tackle box just for my crappie stuff. So, you know, I do a little crappie fishing here time to time. So really needed something. Um, you can see right there, got backyard bass on that side and to flip it over. He actually put my little logo there with the uh, YouTube logo, which was really, really awesome. So just wanted to say thank you to Danny. He's an awesome guy to follow. If you guys are into baseball cards and stuff, you know, he does unpackaging all the time. It's really, really kind of neat. Um, I know a lot of the guys on my channel are kind of a little bit older guys and probably were still in that era of having baseball cards and knew how cool they were. So he's definitely worth checking out. And he also does some fishing videos too. So, you know, make sure you guys go over there, check him out. And I will have everything linked for his channel right down here in the description for you. So it's not hard to find. You can just click that and go right to his channel. And once again, thank you, Danny. I appreciate it. First one of the day, not a bad one, about two pounds, so good little chunk there. Yeah, I think it'll be cute. Oh. Mm. Yeah, it is. Good. Damn. 
It was supposed to be, ain't it? Mm. Another one? All right, guys, number two. He's a little bitty guy, a little bit dink, but still fun to catch. Uh, kind of figuring him out here a little bit. What they're doing is they're they're not up on the bank really. They're up probably about six foot of water out off the bank a little bit. So we'll keep focusing on that and see what we can do. Right, guys number three still not a big big one but man they're eating up good so caught that one on that spinner bait yeah Well guys, they're getting smaller, but that's all right. The only good part about this is when you take your wife fishing, she makes you sandwiches. Guys, one more. Not a big one, but man, they're hitting pretty hard. They're finally getting a little feisty.
get it. Oh! Damn, honey, that was the best one today. Oh, guys, there's another one. A little square bill fish. It got hung up in some rocks. As soon as I popped the thing loose, he just hammered it. So, pretty decent one there. About two pounds. Now you know where to fish when you come over here for tournaments. Yeah, where I started up. Where you got them first. Where you caught all them. Oh, I always fish those. Do what? But I always fish them. Ooh. Damn. Yeah. Ooh, okay. Pain all over the place. All right, guys, another one, a little chunker. Not, nothing too bad on that square bill again. They're heating up on that pretty good today, so we'll stick with that for a little bit. me today. <laughs> Barely hooked too. Yeah. Ouch. Alright guys, there's another one. We're warming up. Doing good. I'd love, I'd love to put a set down the pond. As long as you're with me, we won't never have any. You're nuts. They're nice. I grew up with them. 
Yeah, those uh, <coughs> steps are absolutely beautiful. Looks like they're all stone, don't it? Probably are. Beautiful. There you go. Another nice. Oh.